Hey y'all, thanks for stopping in. Appreciate you taking time out of your busy schedule to stop in and see what it is I'm up to. Welcome to Pandemonium Palace. The noise you hear out there is Uncle Bob and the two littles. <laughs> anyway, uh, we're here at the daughter's house. I had said something about making a chicken pasta salad. Gave her a couple of ideas. And then I got here and she had had a few ideas of her own. So here's what she actually got. We have spinach, a cucumber, black olives, cherry tomatoes, basically I think that's what they are, something like that, cheddar cheese, rotisserie chicken, chicken strips, breast. Cheese tortellini, and this is a, a submarine dressing, basically olive oil, vinegar, and oregano. It's good. It really is. I just tried some. And then we have uh, we're gonna do garlic bread using hot dog rolls because you got too many hot dog rolls. So let me get this kitchen a little bit organized for me and I'll bring y'all back to show you what I'm doing. Okay, I was misinformed. These are cheese and spinach totally. Yeah. So over here if I can, Yeah. In here I have the water getting ready to boil. And in it, I added garlic powder, onion powder, and oregano. The way I look at it, people are always saying, season your water, and then they throw salt in it. Well, salt's okay. It's not really seasoning the water, as far as I'm concerned. And I'm on a low-sodium diet. So, yeah. I don't add salt. About ready to boil. Got a little simmer going. So we'll add these in here. Like so. Put that lid back on. I'm going to turn this pan on. Now, I've never done this for this for chicken before. Apparently she went online and looked at the reviews and whatnot before ordering it. And there isn't a whole lot of it. My, my, my. I'll show you what I mean. You see that? Ah, I'll take a picture. <laughs> okay, freezer to the rescue. She had about a half a bag of this. Pulled chicken breast, grilled and ready. This is the one she usually uses. So I've got that added in there. Uh, we'll see how it goes. Okay, I got some butter. I added some garlic to it. I asked the daughter for Parmesan cheese, and she already added in fresh grated Parmesan. I got a little bit of olive oil here. I don't need a whole lot. Now I'll mix this up nicely. 
I'm going to let it sit and soften just a little bit more. Mix this up and make up some garlic bread. Yeah. Yeah, he most of that. <laughs> Mixed up, I'll take a picture and I'm gonna start making I'm gonna chop up the spinach and then I'm gonna make up some barbecue bread. Okay, I've added some tomato, some cucumber, some chopped up lettuce, some shredded cheddar, some shredded parmesan, and this original submarine dressing from Walmart. This stuff tastes like Philadelphia. Oh my god, is it good? Oh man, unbelievable. Mm. Anyway, let me know what you think, folks. Give me a thumbs down or a thumbs up. Leave me a comment wherever it is y'all leave comments on your internet access device of choice. If you'd like to share me around on your social media, that'd be fandoculous. If you'd like to check me out on Facebook, Instagram or Twitter I'll have links in the description box wherever that happens to be on your device of choice if you love them nearby give them a kiss and a hug if they're not give them a call hit them up on Facebook let them know you think about them let them know you love them we ain't promised tomorrow people we ain't promised our next breath so I see y'all again I hope you have a fandoculous day slaunch it y'all Bye-bye. This is a good thing she brought out that big tin. <laughs> oh, man. That's going to be good.